Oh, what was your fucking member? Your name, your fucking oh. label maker name, Senior Wit. I can't remember. Senior label. Maker. It was Senior Something's Carpet Emporium. Aye. Oh, I remember this. I do. But we I don't were in the back of his ma's motor. In a non-sexual way. Senior Escobar. His mother was present, something. still in a non-sexual way. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Mostly. <laughs> I might have enjoyed. Some. I'm not gonna. Anyway, we're anything. back for part. <laughs> Six of the guys. Oh, you ruined. Right. At this point, is it, I'm not instead of telling point. them the part, why don't we tell them what date it is? Because I'm <laughs> sparing our content. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, <it's> captain's log. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we're in the depths, and I've been relegated to doing this. Uh, Fuck yeah, depths. I mean, do you but want this? Do, is, this is do you want to do this? No. <laughs> <laughs> this well, is I left you in the depths when I left your house. How did you get on? That actually, I did fine. Actually. Good. Well, there you go. Get going. Uh, this is different it. though, because this is prepare to die again, mod. And the rekindled mod. What are you doing? Why don't we oh, talk? I need to get the large, large ember, like a large ember, right? Well, the, the, the guys already know because we went through it in the first part. Are you going to yeah, do? Oh, so the game should also. Be fair, part one was probably about a year ago by now. So let's just yeah, recap. Yeah, yeah. So the prepare to die again and the rekindled mod rebalance the weapons and armors and shit like that. Changes some of the stats. The prepare to die again mod changes enemy placements, loot locations, uh, updates some of the bosses to have different effects. Basically, the game just gets shuffled around a little, but it's deliberate, not randomly shuffled. So the prepare to die again good. mod oh, well, will always play the same way. Basically. One better chaos isn't better chaos anymore. Anyway. Yeah, that's different. Wow! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Another thing, pinwheel has been changed ever so slightly. Does it? I don't know about that. And and Taurus, Taurus, well, I'm not going to tell you because you're going to see it when you get to Catacombs. And, t- right. and, Taurus, and Neato, Neato has been changed exactly the way you'd expect him to. Bone wheels? Mm. I mean, that's yes. exactly what I was expecting. There's bone wheels, no, but the actual big skeletons are part of the fight. Because ah, okay. instead of them uh, coming to life based on your proximity to them, they just come to life based on the stage of the boss fight. Ah, so yeah, the fight yeah. So Taurus Demon also has a new element to its fight as well. Is it not? It's sure? just cancer. The uh, new element is cancer. Really? It's like an NPC from Dark Root Forest, but he's fucking broken because he just spams a Met Force and two shots with a claymore. <laughs> he's a prick and I hate him. So he's your average so he online Dark Souls player. Oh, he's just there while you fight the Taurus Demon. I you found that before the Taurus. Demon? No, no, what you have to do is line demon. the Taurus Demon up to yeah, really kill the, the guy. Demon. No, he can damage the Taurus Demon. The Taurus Demon can damage him, but he will not aggro on the Taurus Demon. He'll only do damage if he clips with the Taurus Demon. But all you have to do is just put him between you and the Taurus Demon, and let the Taurus Demon beat the shit out of him. Well, so I'll tell you what, more having the yeah, items yeah. and stuff like relocated, it it basically it feels like you're playing the game. When did you get a Balder side sword? I think it just gives you. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's, it's, it's um, about fucking time. It's on the bridge where the claymore was. Wait, I just realised I came down here to get the Who large ember here. Oh yeah, it won't be there's down a here, will it? in the starting area. There's a what? No, you see, who uses the claymore when there's a vihand on the starting area? Oh, I mean the claymore. Well, it wasn't there this time. Oh yeah, it's true. There's vihand. It wasn't there this time. That's good. It was so not worth the run. It was actually very right. not worth the run. Oh, right, fucking uh, drop damage, this bitch. Some shit. Soul packet probably. Just drop so it. Back it's but literally, almost every item in the game has been changed. There's some items that haven't been changed. No. Um, Just drop it. No. Why? I think Firekeeper Souls have got different locations as yeah, well. They do. Yeah, they I've only like, found five of them. You can kill it now, You can kill it now. Yeah, just hit it with the fucking it won't. sweet plot. So there is like. Right, so the there was massive, massive amounts of frame drops initially, but I realised what the problem was. So basically. Why you fixed it then? Oh, well, no, that it's is, still that because that was like fixed. many particles. Oh, fuck. Right, so no, it used to start like every five to ten seconds. It was like. Whenever it was loading in horrible. new textures, basically. Yeah. So the reason oh, for that enemies. was. So the reason was, is in the folder where you put all the texture replacements. Uh, you can't. Look at the enemy. Oh, right. Oh, shit. Look at yeah, the enemy. Like one of those Little crab enemies. man from DS. Like the oh. one they have in DS2. Now, I'm going to give you one warning okay. about this guy. He has a lot of poise. <laughs> Like, I mean broken amounts of poison. I'm thinking that's probably why I wasn't in the game. It took me four swings from a great club to stagger him. <laughs> wow. And he just looks like a fucking undead hollow. Okay, I'm going to go down the legit way. That's not no, go with a shortcut. Nuts. Get Open the shortcut. Don't be a... There isn't a shortcut here too fucking open. Yes, there is. There is. You can slide down the ramp and go up the staircase yeah, and just... open the shortcut to the bonfire. Yeah, you, hug, do you hug to the yeah. left. You hug the left okay, and slide down. Okay, I'll do down. it. Then. I know how to do it. You okay. can still do all of the depths this way. This just gives you the shortcut to the bonfire so that if you do die in the depths, you don't need to fucking go all the way back up to where the butchers are. Oh, I guess. So, right. Point is, though. Oh, oh that was one of the crab men. Crab men. Crab man. Can you backstab him? Yeah. Waiting on the beach. <laughs> Right, so anyway, the point is, is the reason why... how vicious crabs are. Oh, that's like... Yes. Yes. I tried the day man they stuck in my head. They eat baby there. turtles. Yeah. And anything else that, you know, approaches them, including other crabs. 
Yeah, that is true. I well. feel that like crabs are the um, like the absolute bottom of the food chain. Sometimes, like I've never seen a crab. Yeah, that's like, krill, mate. Yeah, that's, cr- that's. No, but like I mean, like every animal just abuses crabs. Like they just don't get a fucking break. Yeah, but everything smaller than crabs or about the same size gets abused by crabs. Yeah. Nah. It's they do. The, it's definitely near the bottom. Like it's fucking pin bottom. a snail against a crab. I know it's winning. <laughs> Yeah. And a snail just consumes the crab. <laughs> <laughs> Unequivalently, like the crab's like gone. Well, I don't think you, you know how two, snails you eat. You get two crabs in a bucket and the crabs are fucked. What, because the bucket eats the crabs? No, no, no. Right, so you put one crab in a bucket, right? It right. can get out the bucket. Put two crabs in a bucket, neither of them will get out. What? How? Because both of them want out first and <laughs> can't understand <laughs> that one of them has to get out first and they'll both keep dragging each other down. <laughs> Just a battle of wits. It's fucking mental. A battle of wits. <laughs> no matter how many a crabs are in that battle. Like, you need to understand, right, it's not about getting out of the bucket, it's whether a crab can fucking flex the hardest on the other crab. That's <laughs> what matters. Well, there's a principle at stake here. <laughs> well, you can get them piled up above the bucket. Look, and history they doesn't write stories about the last guy at the bunker. They write stories about the first guy. <laughs> <laughs> so what you're saying is crabs have got a good sense of history, like? Probably. Ah, I know that history is written by the winners exactly and the winner's the first guy out the bucket it basically is like right whoever, what I mean? whoever crab gets out the bucket first is the one that gets to say the other crab it did a lot of damage <laughs> it did a lot of damage yeah a fair amount yeah. and we all know that as soon as you accuse so someone being a pedophile in social court they instantly lose they, they don't look anything like wait, crabs wait what what well, what about social court? Like if you if you accuse someone of being like a paedophile or a rapist, immediately in social court, as in the general public's opinion, they lose. Oh, that guilty. Doubt. Yeah. Guilty. Hence why Elon Musk won that argument against that guy. <laughs> yeah. Elon Musk won every argument for everybody for the history of mankind. It's now. No, no, no. I don't think you can do that. I don't think you can stockpile good deeds to like <laughs> pay off no, 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 a story saying, in future. What, what I'm saying is that by. By Elon Musk setting the precedent of just going whatever pedo is a fucking <laughs> argument it's like, it's like a, a rich kid's version of your mom game. <laughs> just whatever pedo. No, the rich kid ones like you don't know hard, how hard my life is. Like I clearly be man. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, you don't know how hard my life is. I had to drive to work in my Bugatti today. <laughs> Because I'm going for fucking, my you Tesla was in the shop. I'm going for slightly higher middle class. I'm not going for the fucking rich kids on Instagram. Aye. Had a bad meeting today because my lucky underwear were in my other mansion. It's the best sword in the game. Yeah, it is, it is the best. Although it might not be because it's been rebalanced. Has it? Yeah, all the or weapons, the, scalings, and yeah. stats have been rebalanced. Oh, right, but that's not a trait. Yeah, it's been. It's good. It still is good, by the yeah. way. Just Watch so you this? know, I used it all oh. right at the end of the game as well. Was that always Lodge Tenet? Yeah. Oh. Got lazy then, didn't they? Not every <laughs> item's been changed. Lazy halfway through. Yes! A lot of the. A lot What's of the. About? Because the rest just never drop humanity for us. It's like a, it's like really? a curse. Yeah. They drop all the time for me. Must be see, nice! See Must be one. fucking nice! See yes. that rat in the aqueduct on the way to Undeadburg? It's literally dropped humanity for me once in the thousands of times I've killed it. <laughs> Yeah, generally I'll get a humanity for it once per playthrough or so. Maybe I mean, twice. why don't why don't you just fucking why? whap your dick out on the table if this is the I way you want to go? That was a bit Would that like, be super right. content? Yeah. Would you say? Uh, we can blur it. Oh, okay. As long as there's a blur on it and we like don't like make a thumbnail with a red circle <laughs> hand towards it. Sam gets his bobby out. No, I don't want to do As soon as you undo the zipper <laughs> Ali A intro. Who's Ali A? A wasp kind of. He does Fortnite videos. He, he just, he's like what, the, the most the clickbaity f- YouTuber. What? Ali Law's a country oh. like. Oh, okay. Go subscribe is, uh, to Ali Law. Law. Yeah, Ali Law is the best uh, channel on YouTube. Who's Ali Law? Uh, he breaks into places and then just waits for the polos to come and get him. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, that is it. <laughs> <laughs> that has to be against community guidelines. Well, it appa- has to be. Apparently, it's not technically a crime, it's a civil issue. So the police try to stick shit on him all I'm the time, like sure burglary and shit. They can't prove that he's trying to burgle anywhere. But isn't breaking in also, a crime? He, he doesn't break bro- in. He, he broke into Big Brother. How does he not break in? He just sneaks in and hides. Yeah. But that's breaking in. No, that's hiding. No, it's, it's a, breaking in. It's hiding. The law, the law works on technicality. Under a law, on a code I mean, of law. I guess, hiding. in a technicality, <laughs> if he doesn't break it, like, if he just, like, if the house is already open and he opens the door and walks in, he's technically not broken Apparently in. Apparently, in so Scotland, it's perfectly up. legal to do that. This is some, this yeah, is yeah, some you, sovereign you, citizen you. bullshit right here. <laughs> This is some sovereign citizen bullshit. This is bringing up maritime law for cars and shit. Wait, what, what, David? <laughs> <In the sea? laughs> I think you'll find I don't need a driver's license because I'm travelling. <laughs> <laughs> 
I have to show you this shit on YouTube later. It's hysterical. People believe this. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, it's oh, it's people who like so get pulled over by police and they're like, "You can't arrest me, officer. I'm a sovereign citizen, thus I'm not following oh, your I law." I hate these people so much because it's just no, it's, it's a one way ticket to being put in the cell. Like that's all it is. So like one hundred percent. What they believe is that when you're born, your birth certificate is written off against some of the country's debt. <laughs> <laughs> it's so weird. Um, and they, they, oh, they believe... I'm teething. <laughs> I'm teething. The, 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 they've got this idea Surely in their heads not. that because of this, yeah. the government wow. owes them money. That's mad. So they can write off bills and shit by saying, um, I want this written off my birth certificate. Um, and they, be, they do this shit and they eventually, you know, get taken to jail for it and like... Right. And... It's just so bizarre. Like, there's so what, many people believe in this bizarre set of ideas that they think will get them away with anything, and it never does. Yeah, there's like, one, there's I've one heard so many people it. like say shit like, "Oh, I, I don't consent to like." You, I know there are certain ones where this does apply. Like the police officer's breaking in the window. I do not consent to arrest. <laughs> <laughs> You're breaking the law, sir. <laughs> yeah, right, well, I've, I'm the one with the gun, so come on, let's get in the fucking squad car. You're yeah, yeah, in Britain, son. There's an aspect fucking... to it that I don't think you might You're not Britain, know this. Son, do you have a license for not being arrested? I don't think so. <laughs> you might not know this side of the sovereign citizen thing, and I think Tony would love to hear it. But there's okay, a side okay. of it where some of them like see the name that they have in America, for example. They don't believe that is them as a person, that is the entity they, like, that is the persona they inhabit. Like, they're right. born. So, yeah, I've seen a guy in court arguing debts and that right head, like, 130 grand he owed. And he yeah, was like, saw this, I saw this it. guy, who was, they were like, just for the sake of just putting around me, fucking John <gasps> Doe, right? right? And he was like, I, as a person, I, as a body, do not owe the debt. The person, John Doe, owes the debt. And it's like, you are John Doe. And like, no, no I'm I am the body who has <laughs> John Doe. I am here representing John Doe, and John Doe is you. No, John Doe is my name. <laughs> yes, yeah, like this. So he's arguing a separation of body and personal responsibility, basically. Can you imagine if he won it, Bob? It's so, so good, man. Like, if he These guys are actual co Imagine if he did, basically. The police fucking hate them, by the way. The police no wonder because it's just like, oh, here we go. Insane. You just can't make this simple. The police hate Ali Law. They hate him oh, so much. Oh, without a doubt. Like they, he was originally on a on a debt of a hundred on a hundred and fifty. Find out why. Trick. No, but it's so funny. Like there's, there's, a, alley long there's a clip. To any location. He's he's not put up the video yet. Once he gets the footage back, which he's gonna get back soon, we're all fighting for him, right? But there is a clip from Big Brother where they do break in. It's during like when someone's getting evicted and they're looking out the window going. Why oh, is there a wee ginger couldn't jumping in here? And then the shutters all shut down. Goes everyone to the bedroom. Everyone out. <laughs> Oh, I can't believe it. All the way down here to get the fucking large ember now. Oh. It just goes, <laughs> the Nazis are after me. Hide me. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he has this, like, hide him? No, he calls everyone boys in it. It's really weird. But he like, so, goes up to the police like, oh boys, oh boys, shouldn't be doing this, shouldn't be arresting me like this. I can still record, but it's just really funny. Just oh, shit. What have you done? Nailed it. Death's Master 6000. So, what's in unrelated news, didn't you write anything a guide we're on this place, Tony? About? Okay, go on. Wait, what, Sam? And didn't you write a guide on this place, Tony? Yeah, and but it's, it's hard. Of, literally, and I'm being. I, I have done this twice ever. Mate, it's the 60 mm. FPS. It's fucking movies. Only played it on 30. Uh, just but, wait, um, it'll be Shadow to Yarnum. The, uh. Uh. What was I going to say? I just caught, caught a glimpse. See the mad European Games thing that's going on? Is like causing me so much fucking grief because they're all in that fucking hotel that I'm in. European. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. The. Uh, British women won the synchronised diving. First place gold medal. Did they beat the British men? No, the British men won't win it because there's segregation in Olympic sports. Men it's don't Olympics. compete with women. 2018, well, it's, and we're it's still like living in Olympics. sexism. It's like the European Olympics. So what, it's, it's like the Commonwealth Games, but shit? Yeah, basically. It's like the Commonwealth Games too. Commonwealth. No, <laughs> Commonwealth. If the Commonwealth <laughs> Games are so good, <laughs> why isn't there a Commonwealth Games too? Well, as it turns out, there is. <laughs> <laughs> if World War Two was so good, why isn't there a World War Three? Oh wait, we're already almost there. Keep your eye yeah. on it; it'll be here soon. Sometime. Coming soon. <laughs> Coming soon to, to a Middle East near, near you. Anyway, go on. That's it. He's told you the story. Wait, so no, that was it. I just wanted to say that. That's why what I were you going to say? Right, there was a weird. You said that with a weird stink in your voice, Stephen. Can I have a no? I want to just, just no. like the woman. <laughs> The okay. woman won the synchronised mm. the fucking I didn't I didn't I let them in the pool. I Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't say it with any sort of condescending tone. Stop trying to I mean, well, I, I, don't know I, mean I heard a wee so bit of condescending is that we should kill all women. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Fuck it! <laughs> <laughs> is that 
<laughs> I mean, I could never be involved with like some massive like publicity scandal like when PewDiePie called that guy nigger and like that. Professor, I could never Professor be involved Peterson. in that because eventually people just call me all this shit and I'm like, I right, fuck it up. <laughs> and then I just fly into the deep end and go full fascist and all that shit. Uh, pr- Professor Peterson, it's alright if I call you Joe. <laughs> 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 I would, man. I'd just end up embracing it and be, be like, you know what, fuck it. You want me to be like this? Fine, I'll be the worst possible version of this. <laughs> it's like the old Eminem, isn't it? But, uh, John Peterson is right. Forced monogamy is the way to go. <laughs> I agree. The government should provide girlfriends for people. Yes. <laughs> They should be harvested like that fucking. I actually that find it kind of again? funny. I find it kind of funny that um, <laughs> incels are what becoming if more. A toaster. They're becoming more sort of in the public sphere of knowledge now for some reason. What, incels, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and yeah I, I find it really funny oh, because more and more people are seeing how batshit insane these people are. Did you see the video of the guy? I don't know how to solve the incel problem. I think they're worse for the spotlight on them. To be totally honest. No, I, yeah, they're I now worse. So it's, it's the way I've, it's I've the seen them on R nine K being absolute retards for years. Oh no, they are. They think women are the problem. Yeah, because women are Alassie the Alassie came in the stream do. yesterday. Alassie came in the stream, and the first thing one wee bastard down was just like, Oh, you're about fucking stupid women. Nah. It's like, What are you actual Dane? You're in real life right well, now. Do, do, you know what, do you know what girl means on the internet? Oh, here we go. Okay. Guy in real life. <laughs> Which, right, in today's <laughs> political compass, it could also actually be. I mean, it's okay. kind of transphobic to say it, but then who? They don't, no, have they don't so say it. I've, <laughs> des- I've decided I'm gender fluid today, so you know. Oh well, I mean, there you go then. Oh, you're Immunity fine. from responsibility. That's Jordan it. Peterson or Jordan Peterson's? Because right now I'm seeing two. <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, I prefer the term Führer. I was going to say the same thing. <laughs> you can leave. What do we no. get from this? I'm in charge. Oh, what do you get? In a, you can leave. Oh, okay, cool. Did you see Dan killing me? How come he didn't get a pug? Because pugs are shit. You're right. It's pretty cruel to get them. Like, they just shouldn't be bred. Well, honestly, they, they should. Them. Yeah, I agree. They, they, I think it's actually cruel to breed them because they are just technically an abomination. Basically, <laughs> they are. Can... It's fucking species like fucking like backyard chemistry. <laughs> so it is that. It's, <laughs> it's like know, fucking. What the fuck? It's like the dog equivalent of a back alley abortion. <laughs> There's two of them now. Oof. Fuck me, man! It's it's more like a the dog equivalent of like a a trailer park meth. It's bar. like back in fucking Nazi things when Hitler was trying to create weird fucking human animal combinations. Aye, because yeah. that's what Hitler was trying to do. Uh, to be fair, Goebbels was doing shit like yeah. that. It was really fucking bizarre. It was really fucked up shit. There was human experimentation in Nazi Germany. Aye, but I don't think they were trying to like create dog human hybrid. No, because they they fucking tried this. This document. Ah, uh, elephant human hybrids. That's what you want. Because you have two people in the room telling you that they did. Right. Granted, these two people lie to you a lot for the sake of making you feel like an idiot, but we're telling you the truth this time. <laughs> And I feel like the fact that I told you that is proof enough that we are. No, like, right, so the reason that, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna look at that. I'm gonna look this look up. Look it up. Enjoy. The reason why I don't buy into this is because the whole Search point. Nazi like, chimera experiments. The whole point and what the Nazis were trying to do was make like this. Man's got the man's on the fucking money with the name of it. Chimera <sighs> experiments. What does that tell you? You know what a chimera is. <laughs> it's after it's Hitler's, bad, but I'm not believing the first post because after Hitler's pal died, that's how it's starting this. Nazis recreate his. Oh, right, no, that's not even it. Nazis medical experiments. Mm. Well, let's try that. There's nothing showing Chimera. I think you've been diving too far onto that dark web. I think you have been. <laughs> too much in that. I, I heard this in a YouTube video as well, by the way. That, that oh, because YouTube's the height of knowledge. No, no, they were talking about this, and it was a joke that they made that was like, see if Nazis. Because um, they were talking about, like, anime fans and how. Anime whips <laughs> aren't actually into Japanese culture, they're into like their own idea of what Japanese yeah, culture yeah, is yeah, based yeah, on yeah. anime. And he was basic and he was saying, Do you think if the Nazis won, they'd have been the first ones to give Japan Fox Girls? Fox Girls? Yeah, because they're all into the fucking Kitsunis and all that shit. Right. Because they're weird cunts. Hybrid and chimeras. Yeah, and the Nazis done all the fucking weird human experiments and shit like that. I don't think Nazis would have been Well, this is actually in two thousand and seven. They'd have probably made like weird fucking. How does that make it irrelevant? World War Two was like one hundred <laughs> fucking years ago. That's what I'm saying. So it doesn't. Oh, 2007. This is of ill repute because it's. No, no. You're saying it was back in Hitler's time that this happened. Yes, but right? it doesn't mean. Yes, but it can be reported on after it happened, Ryan. No, but they're saying they were doing it in 2000. You cannot no, be not. serious. They were not doing it in 2007. The right, so, right, on so it's not believable time. that they're doing it in 2007, but it's perfectly reasonable that it was getting done there in 1945. There is documentation that there were yeah. experiments. The Nazis were around then, they're not around now. They were doing it back then, they're not doing it now. Yeah, almost that's like, not what when they're not here, they can't do it. 
That's not what I'm saying. Crazy. That's not what I'm saying. Your first. It sounds like that's what you're saying. No, what that's I'm exactly. What no, you're what saying. I'm saying. What I'm saying is this report is about someone doing it in 2007, and you're so, going, no, it happened during how are much? Are you sure the report what? just wasn't from 2007? This right? is what I'm saying. <laughs> that's what you're implying. No, you it, could have meant something else, but what you said. No, was this what is about this. someone who was doing the experiment in 2007. Right. So because said, someone was doing it in 2007, the Nazis couldn't have been doing it back then. <laughs> that's what there I mean. we go, guys. Close the books. No, that's what I thought you were saying. No, that's not what I was saying. What I was saying right, is then there's been an entire mass match of communication. Yes, there point. has. That's right. The next point. subject: <laughs> Alex Jones is banned for YouTube. <laughs> Let's talk about that. Why is done? Ha ha! Well, they might get back. Look, I don't care. First they came for Alex Jones, and I didn't care because I wasn't <laughs> Alex Jones. <laughs> <laughs> who was saying who do you think he's just be next? an example? Oh, I, I, no, I'd, I'd say, say Logan Paul, but he's making too much money. No, he's making well, YouTube wait, back wait, with that's that boxing match. They're going to go after him for making too much money. No, I'm saying that's I would illegal. say it would be Logan Paul, but he's making them too oh, much money, oh, so right. they won't <laughs> Imagine Yeah, Alex we're just going to no, buy you no, ban him. You're just making billions and we hate it. Oh no, what if Alex... Just really we like YouTube, YouTube failing some... year on year. Wait, here, no, I've just actually... Find out why. I've just actually thought about it. What if Alex Jones just calls out the head of YouTube and challenges her to a boxing match <laughs> to get his channel <laughs> reinstated? <laughs> I'd watch it. I'd watch it. I'd watch make it pay-per-view. Boxing gloves off, kicks the shit <laughs> Logan Paul KSI one's pay-per-view, by the way. Yeah, I know. But it'll obviously I mean, be streamed. It'll obviously be streamed on basically every fucking. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, Think. UFC's pay per view, and it took me See, no at this point, I want Logan Paul to win purely for the fact the part will be fantastic. Oh, oh it'd incredible. be amazing. It'd be hilarious. <laughs> Just Logan Paul's a racist. Um... Think of all the videos people will make. KSI Logan got, got beat by well, a man with only 85% of his testicles. They'll, they'll dig up that fucking. <laughs> what? They'll dig yeah, up that suicide. Testicle cut off. They'll dig up the really? suicide yeah. forest video and they'll superimpose yeah. KSI that's onto that's the hanging body. See, when. Like, the lights are matter. Because it was part of their boxing match, like uh, talk down to each other, and it was a big thing. Case I, I was going in for like, you've only got half a bomb, mate. I'll better take your bud over and pump it instead. A hundred percent, right here. That was these. He's I mean, some pretty he shape black, pattern. So realistically, yeah, he's black. One hundred and fifty percent. Are you saying black people have shape pattern? Not in no, every they case. No, they can get away with shape pattern. Have you ever seen black Twitter? They've got great pattern. This scene. This scene. They have a, a, a type of pattern. Black Twitter is hilarious. I'll give it that, but. Oh, you've only got 15% of a testicle. Ha ha ha. I mean, this it's sounds a lot like you're projecting your 15% lessness of a testicle, Sam. That's no, I'm saying it. this just sounds like playground banter rather than actual banter. It is playground well, banter. It's a fucking and then Logan boxing Paul match. Off stage and Luke then accuse the adjudicator of being like. It's a boxing sided. match between literal two poofs. It doesn't matter. It's a boxing mm. match between two people that everybody hates. So people are just going to watch it because it's two people we hate beating the shit out of well, each other. Obviously, it's win win for everybody. Oh, fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I genuinely yeah. is. But the problem is, is that it's win win the most for those two pricks. They'll make a bunch of fucking money. Oh yeah, yeah there's a documentary movies. about it. They're each coming. They're out making a documentary. Oh no, they're each coming out with their own documentary, and then there's going to be a documentary for the boxing match. It's funny That's because apparently shit, Logan and it'll make bank. Apparently Logan Paul is win. going to be filming his documentary as if he's won. Yeah, and also, it's going to include a lot of so stuff in the suicide So he's kind of like, you know, putting all his eggs in one basket already. Because if he loses the documentary, he's just going to look, make him look like an egotistic fuck. Here we've got the tag. Which he is. Here we've got the tagline for this fucking video now. Uh, we want Logan Paul to win and then it'll just get all the views. Ah, I think that'll get literally zero views. <laughs> it'll get zero views. And oh, finally! Oh, Christ! Well done. I don't, I don't see what your problem is, man. It's a great bus. Dark totally engaging. Oh, here's Paul actually views. a good talking I've point. James Gunn getting sacked for literally making a paedophile tweet. Oh, th this is you actually a very good important point. Yeah. If you stood up for Count Dankula, you should stand up. Wait, wait, wait. We'll, we'll, oh, yeah, we'll, yeah, this on the, for the, we'll continue this for the next part, because that's the end of this part. Oh, we can end it with like a political cliffhanger just here. No, we don't. <laughs>